He may be just a sixth grade boy, but he can smell, he can spell most words we probably can't even pronounce, and I can't even pronounce the word <laughs> spell. Spell or smell. <laughs> 23 ABC's Crystal Figueroa introduces us to a young man who is taking his spelling skills to a national competition and shares the unlikely way he got to the top. Crystal? Jackie, Troy, two months ago, Osvaldo Sanchez participated in the Scripps Spelling Bee competition right here in Bakersfield, but one wrong letter made him second runner-up. Recently, he learned that the first runner-up couldn't make it to the national competition in Washington and was overjoyed to learn that he was the new champ. How do you spell winner? Winner. W-I-N-N-E-R. Winner. <laughs> Osvaldo Sanchez is all smiles after learning that he will represent Kern County in the Scripps National Spelling Bee in Washington next week. It means so much for me because all these people are rooting for me to be able to win and I'm going to try my best. When he competed in Bakersfield two months ago to qualify, a simple word tripped him up. I was eliminated because I misspelled the word revitalize. Um, it was spelled R-E-V-I-T-A-L-I-Z-E, -E, but instead of a T, I spelled it with a D. One wrong letter is enough to get you kicked off the competition, and that's why this time he has backup. He has such a fantastic memory. My, my job is to expose him to the words, the pronunciation, maybe a trick. The training seems to be working. David Sandals is his language arts teacher at Emerson Middle School, but more importantly, his spelling coach. Part of me wishes I could speak for him, but I feel comfortable knowing that he's had the exposure. The rest is in his hands, and I feel I feel like he's uh, he's capable. So I put him to the test. Revenue, revenue, R E V E N U E, revenue. Resurgence, resurgence, R E S U R G E N C E, resurgence. Is there anything you don't know how to spell? Um, <laughs> I'm not sure. He's hitting the books, or the dictionary in his case, all in an effort to make him happy. <laughs> H-A-P-P-Y. And Sanchez hopes that his studying will pay off. He travels to Washington, D.C. this weekend with his father and his spelling coach. The first round of competition is on Tuesday of next week, and of course we're going to follow his progress and let you know if he advances. Reporting in studio, I'm Crystal Figueroa, 23ABC.